Santa and today we're going to be doing a new and improved middle split stretch routine with the best stretches so you can get your middle splits fast. Even if you're not flexible at all, I will be showing beginner modifications to the more advanced stretches so that everyone can follow along and if you already have your middle splits, this is also a great hip stretching routine to maintain or improve your hip flexibility and even work towards middle over splits as long as you go as deep into the stretches as you can. Before we stretch, I would really appreciate it if you could like this video and subscribe to my channel for lots more stretching routines and fun videos to come. With all that said, let's go ahead and get right into this middle split stretch routine. To start, reach down to the ground and then turn your feet so that your toes are pointing outwards. In this position, we're going to do 10 plie squats and when you're doing these, make sure that your knees are going out to the side, not in front of you. On your last one, keep your legs bent and then use your arms to try to push your legs even further back to get a deeper stretch in your hips. Now keep one leg bent and straighten the other leg. In this position, try to push the straight leg as close to the ground as you can. Repeat the last stretch except bending your other leg. Now take the knee of the leg that is bent and place it on the ground. Then try to push your hips towards the ground. Obviously you won't be able to get all the way down until you have your full middle splits. So just go as low as it takes for you to feel the stretch. Next, do the same stretch bending your other leg. And now bend both legs. All of the stretches in this routine are very effective for getting your middle splits. So don't give up, I know you can finish this routine and eventually get your middle splits. From here, go into a seated position and place the soles of your feet together. Once you are sitting like this, push your legs towards the ground to feel a deeper stretch in your hips.
keeping your legs in the same position, reach up and then over top of them to get an even deeper stretch. You can now sit back up and then place one foot over top of its opposite knee. Once you have your legs in the right position, push the top leg towards the ground. Now just switch the leg that is on top. For the next few stretches, it's best if you can go to a wall or if you don't have a wall nearby, just follow the modifications. Once you're by a wall, go into a straddle position facing the wall and then try to push your legs as close to the wall as you can. There's only a few minutes left of this routine and these last stretches are some of the more effective ones, so no point in stopping now, I know you can make it through until the end. Next, lay on your back with both legs flat against the wall. For the first stretch in this position, place an ankle over top of the thigh on the opposite leg, then try to pull both legs towards your chest. But something knocked you out. You felt your limitations and filled your mind with doubt. You want to stay chill right now And don't let your eyes off the prize I know you want it to be easy Repeat that last stretch with your other ankle crossed over. Straighten both of your legs and then place them flat against the wall again. Once your legs are straight, try to push them as close to the ground as you can. This is a great stretch for getting your middle split, so we're going to hold it for 45 seconds. And throughout that time, see if you can push your legs even closer to the ground. There's only one more stretch left after this one, and I think it's the most important stretch. So you are getting so close. last thing we're going to do I think is the best trick for getting your splits but you do need some pillows to do it so feel free to pause the video here to grab some.
Now that you have some pillows, stack up as many as you need to go all the way down to touch them in your middle splits. Now we're going to hold the middle splits on your pillows for 30 seconds. And every time that you do this routine, try to remove a pillow until you can get all the way down to the ground in your middle splits. If you need to use the same amount of pillows a few times that you do the routine, that's completely normal. Just try to gradually remove the pillows and then eventually over time, you should get your full middle splits. For fast results, I recommend following along to this routine and anywhere is from three to seven days a week, whatever you can fit into your schedule. You can share your results by using the hashtag Anna McNulty Challenge on Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube Shorts for the chance to be featured in one of my videos. And here is another stretching routine you can do if you feel like stretching for longer. Bye!